But the soup is still very sweet. Try it and testify. You want me to eat swallow from breakfast? Hey, also not swallow. This is not swallow. This is apple. It's water water. I went to the market to buy it by myself. I was looking for you. I was looking around and around and around. I did not see it. But later I saw it and I was very happy. <laughs> it is good. I pounded it by myself. It is good. You will like it. Relax, we can still spin things around. And besides, it's not nice to call your wife a thing. Why not? I mean, which same person serves swallow for breakfast? <laughs> wait, wait, come on, relax. It probably that's how she was raised. She's, she's just so dumb. <laughs> All right, relax. She's just a sweet girl, like a sweet village girl, you know? And why did you, why did you even marry her? As if I had a choice. But I warned you. I couldn't go against my mother, even if I wanted to. Ah, oh boy, fix it and stop being a mama's boy. Hey, please. Stop it right there. Do not insult me. Okay. okay? Right. This is my cross. Allow me to carry it. Okay, big boy. See how you're carrying it. Okay, what's up? What are you doing tomorrow? Uh, nothing much. Just some paperwork. Okay. <laughs> Friend of mine asked me to come to an act exhibition tomorrow. You want to come? Well, anything that is going to distract me from work and from going home, I am gay. <laughs> really, this is not funny. I'm not really in the mood. Anyway, with the way your marriage is going, man, I think I've been single for some time. That's your problem. If you like, wait till you're 50 years. Oh. Anyway, after run. I'll pick you tomorrow by four. Right. Big boy. Get up, get up, get up. <laughs> I'll see you tomorrow. Okay, tell him I'll be with him shortly. Okay. This is beautiful. Who is he? This is Nathan. <coughs> okay, um, it is beautiful and I've heard so much about him already and I cannot wait to see him. But please, do not keep Mr. Clinton waiting. She knows he's not a patient man. Uh, yes, just try and keep him busy with something, okay? I'll be with him shortly. Okay, we'll just finish this up. There is no inspiration behind this. Nonsense. There is no art without inspiration. It's okay. If you don't want to share, there is no problem. Um, I can understand. 
some things are better kept than the heart than sharing with them. Well, I, I painted this two years ago. I mean, it helped me heal a lot during my depression, pain, and heartbreak. Bit by bit, day by day, I would cry at night. I poured my feelings in this art. It really means a lot to me. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. You really have a test for a good wine. Um, expect a glowing review from me. Really? Yes. Oh my goodness, thank you so much. Thank you. Hey. Yeah, I have to go now. Hmm? Thank you so much for stopping by. I'll make you a check for this. That is, if the price is fair. Um, I'm sorry, but... This is not for sale. Really? Yeah. <laughs> it's okay. If you make up your mind on this to sell, bring it to my house. Hmm? Thank you for stopping by. I wish you well. What is he up to? I wish I knew. But trust me, he is up to no good. You have to be careful around him because I do not like him one bit. And I don't like him either. Yes, uh, so, you know, I will have to come and show you, yes, <coughs> okay, no problem, <coughs> alright, thank you, bye bye, what is it? I came to tell you that food is lady. Is that what you're finding so difficult to say? It's because I don't want you to shout at me. Okay. I am not hungry. Since I came into this house, you hardly eat my food. Wait, oh. Do you want to shove the food down my throat even when I'm not hungry? Mba. Don't be angry, oh. It will go anywhere. There is something else I want to ask you. It has been bothering me since. Okay, what is it? Your mother, my family. Uh, Ngozi, can you go straight to the point? Oh, what is it? The thing is that your mother, she. Can you stop blabbing and tell me what the problem is? What has my mother done? She is asking when we will have a baby. What? Hey, don't be angry. They are the ones asking me. I am not the one asking them. Eh? Manoya de Kwanu Mana, or Bruno with small small children that are running around in the house. Eh? Kahani Bunuma Hokono, since you are not always around. Okay. I am not ready to have children. When will you be ready? Eh? How are you going to be We cannot be sleeping in separate rooms unless no one is going to because if it is sharp, you will not be running away from me. Ngozi, are you tired? Tired of what? Are you tired of this marriage? Hey! Mbano! When should I be tired? When we are just starting? Well, like I said, I am not ready to have children. If it's a problem for you, you're free to walk out of this marriage. Oh, 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 Makanda, see before you know it now, they will start talking, talking, talking. That, that you are not capable, eh? Meanwhile, I know that you are capable. Ngozi, can you leave me alone? Leave me alone. Okay, 
So you're not going to tell me who your friend is? Relax. Let's not see her. Your love interest? <laughs> I wish. It's a surprise. Calm down, man. Well, she better be pretty. I wish. <laughs> Nathaniel. Good afternoon, Mom. What is good about this afternoon? Eh, hey, Nata? I have been calling you since morning. Why did you keep your phone? Mom, I... <laughs> Don't even go explaining. I want to tell you, Nata, I am in your house already. Hmm? Now beg you come now. So whatever you are doing, just round it up. Now, 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 and start coming home. You know you Hello? Mom. Hello? What's up, man? My mom is in my house. What does she want? I'm sure you got called her over. Oh, really? Like it was fighting? If it was a fight, that would have been better. What's up, man? What's she up? wants a child. <clears throat> but my man, don't you think it's high time already? Hmm? It's been a year and a half, and what are you waiting for? I am not ready. I don't think I'll ever be ready. You ought to be ready, man. I ought to? Really? Yeah, man. What do you mean I ought to? Don't tell me that. Okay, fine. Let's go. What do you mean what I what, what, what do I mean? Okay, fine. We're not talking about it. Ah, ask now. Go ask the man. Eli? Eh, whoa. Move now. You know, go, Luan. Go, Zika. And I was checking what I have on fire. Oh, yeah, me I was. Uh, 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 ngozika. Ngozika. Uh, so she didn't you are in your husband's house. Why are you working? Is this the way you walk about in your own husband's house? I was being careful so that the water will not spoil. Ngozika. Ngozika, this is why you have not been able to win your husband to your side. Ichukazi no yinu no. Ichukazi no yinu What is it? Ngozika, I need grandchildren. I need grandchildren. And if you continue the way you are going, I am afraid I will have to withdraw my support for you. I will. Who oh, get it? Nay. Nee. That is actually why I called you. How can I give you grandchildren when Nathaniel does not even look at me? He does not eat my food. He hardly say a word to me. If I talk to him, That is why I called you. Because I am tired. Do you know that we don't even sleep in the same room? <laughs> Don't worry. Don't worry yourself. Hmm? I will be here until he comes back. He's going to come back and meet me here. Kangwazeli, I am not leaving this house until you are pregnant. Yes. Ah, but I mean, this place is heat, very, very hot. Eh? Eh. On that AC. I don't know how to on the AC. It's again. Yeah! Ngosika! Chibu, you don't know how to on the AC. You have been here for more than one year. Umokwa yi me. 
Is there anything you know how to do? Hey, Guzika. It would attack her. It is everything you said, but about speaking to your soul and dramatic and whatever. Bro, this is just a painting. Let me tell you, there's a lot we're painting than all these patches of colors that you're seeing. I beg, make her hear. Paint, not paint, brother. Madness. You guys do have a reason. I want to buy it. Well, unfortunately, it has been sold. You're welcome. Thank you. Excuse me, are you the brain behind this artwork? Mm -mm. Actually, my boss. Your boss? Mm -hmm. She has a touch of magic. <laughs> no, I'm serious. This is really nice. You can say that again. My name is Claire and I'm our assistant. Uh, oh, oh cool. Claire. You're beautiful. I'm Frank. Thank you. N nice meeting you. Yeah. She actually said you'd be coming, so let me get her. Uh, okay. Yeah, Thank yeah. you. Hey. What was that? Why are you being so weird? What's the meaning of that? Come on. She's not beautiful. And you have to admire good things when you see one. Really? And bro, this time, I'll marry this one. Oh, you marry this one? Yeah. But don't forget you are here for her boss. <laughs> Sorry. You are here for her boss. What in God's name are you talking about? Why am I here for her boss? <sighs> Watch and Excuse me. Excuse me. Hello? Hurry up, man. Why are you so sluggish? Bring down those clothes. Bring them down. Keep bringing them down. What is it? Mama, you don't know your son, no? Eh? He does not want me anywhere near him. Moving into his room, I don't know how he would take it to. Because, Mama. Do you still want this marriage? Yes, ma'am. Ah, if you still want this marriage, then we will put our heads together and make it work. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Bring them. Bring them. Bring them. Come. Put that thing up. Come. What is it? Come. I'm glad you could make it. How you doing? Oh my goodness. I'm glad you came. I'm so sorry I did not make it on time for your exhibition. I got hooked up with work. It's okay, I understand. Yeah. Well, I'm glad you're here. Yeah, I'm here. Your works are amazing. I, I got some critics online, social media and all those stuff. I even got your interview. I saw your interview with A&A. &A. Oh my God, I'm so proud of you. Thank you so much. You're doing well for yourself. It's God. <laughs> wow. What do we have here? Hi, Nathan. Hi. It's... it's you. Yes, it's me. Actually, he didn't know he was coming to see you. Oh. Well, all the same, I'm grateful. Um. Is this your place? Is this all you? Yes, it is. Wow, man. I'm happy you followed your dreams. I'm so proud of you. you you're doing great. Thank you. <coughs> I'm sorry, I have to go and check the other collections. Look great. Thank you. <laughs> and you look great as well. Oh, thank you. I'm trying. <laughs> it's been a long time. It's so long. Oh. It's good to see you. 
interesting here. We have a lot to catch up on. Yeah, right? <laughs> a whole yeah. lot. <laughs> we have a lot to talk about. Why not? Let's just go to my office so we could talk. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Nathan, I am really happy to see you, and it's been a long time. Yeah, it's been a long time. It's good to see you too. Same here. I mean, you're doing so well. Look, look at your place. It's all art. I know. Thank you. And you're doing pretty well yourself. I'm trying, you know. What can a man do? So, how have you been? Well, I've been good. You know, after what your mother did to me, I, I left for Australia. Yeah, you never reached out. And I tried to reach out to you, but you blocked every means of reaching out to you. My life was a mess. I wanted to forget you. I wanted to, to move away from anything that connects me to you. It must have been hard. Alani, I am truly sorry. Yes, it was hard. But thankfully my painting helped me. It was my best companion, my comfort. Look, it's it's all in the past now, okay? And I guess we both are happy, right? Yeah. You're right. Uh, it's all in the past. And uh, I'm happy to see you. Same here. <laughs> Bro, you don't try. How can you mess me up like this? What did I do? Did you tell me it was her? I wanted to surprise you. Calm down. What kind of surprise is this? I hate cheap surprises. I mean, how can you drag me to meet my ex looking like a noodle? Oh, okay. I get your problem. Is you not looking fresh enough, right? Oh, please, please stop it. I hate myself right now. I wanted you guys to settle things. There is nothing to settle. I am married now. Alani is my past. See, you always fuss for the new shadow. What I mean I want you guys to settle is like for you guys to settle your old grudges. And maybe you can finally heal and focus on your marriage. I hate my marriage. You don't hate your marriage, my man. You only hate the person you are in the marriage with. Okay, and you know, Ngozi can be anything you want her to be. Just a little makeover. That sounds like too much work for me. I don't have time. Okay, fine. Why don't you give her money to sort herself out? You know, new clothes, new hair, total rebranding, stuff like that. She'll be very sharp. Bro, are you even listening to me? Yeah, he goes again. Are you? For whatever wrong you have done. Why? At least for once. Oh, eh? it? Nata, I told you since morning that I am here. I told you. Since morning, but Mba, you just to stay there until late. Oh, the ma, is it good? Mama, don't be like that. I got caught up with a lot of things. Mm. Yes. So those things you got up with. They are more important than your mother. No. Um, I had an impromptu meeting with a client. I use something like this now. Mama the mama. Mama the mama. Mama, how are you? I'm fine. As you can see, I'm fine. <laughs> Nam, I miss you. Mama, I miss you too. It's a lie, you didn't miss me. <laughs> I miss, miss you. You didn't miss me anything. You didn't miss me. <laughs> okay. 
So tell me, what brings you to my humble abode? <laughs> uh, no. Why I came is to ask you one big question. Why have you refused to give me grandchildren? We have met again, Mama. Mama, eh? I thought we have talked about this already. Eh? I am not ready to be a father. Why are you not ready? Yeah. Why are you not ready now? See, okay, if you are not ready, there are things you have to do to be ready. Hmm? Like doing jogging, like this. Eh? You jog, and then uh, where they say you go somewhere to carry all this iron, iron, iron. Eh? The gym. Gym. Uh -huh. You go to the gym, and then you be gymming, 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 until you have enough strength to pregnant your wife. Mama, that is what I, I want you to do. I don't need to go to the gym mm. to have strength to impregnate any woman. Then what is the matter? Mama, I, am, I am just not ready. <laughs> <laughs> Nami, you have to be ready. Oh yes, you have to be ready. You see this one that I have come? Yeah, 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 I am not going. I am not going anywhere until I see that my, my daughter-in-law is pregnant. Fine. You're welcome to stay. Of course I will stay. I am tired. Let me go in and freshen up, okay? I will join you soon. Go ahead and freshen up. I am waiting. I am waiting. We have an unfinished business. Mama, there's no business. Go and come. There's no business. How's your... Oh, yeah. <laughs> emotional blackmail is not going to work on me today so stop it mm. yes mm. and you you think you think when this this nonsense tower will entice me
Come. Mama. Ah, are you scared? Mama. Huh? What is it again? What does it look like? What is she doing in my room? Oh. What else can she be doing in your room? She's your wife. She has come to lie on the bed side by side with you. Mama, can we not do this tonight? I am very tired. Do what tonight? Nem go and sleep. Don't stand there looking at me. Go and sleep. What do you think you want to do? I am going to sleep in the other room if she's going to sleep here. Says who? This is my house and I can do whatever I want to do. Say lie. It's the boom wiki. It's the See, if you leave this room this night, <laughs> I am going to leave your house this minute. And whatever happens to me, you are answerable in the village. Go there and answer that. Ah ah. Mama, she's on the bed now. Can you can you just go? She will sleep here. Don't worry. It's fine. Now, what is even your problem? What I'm asking is not too much. Just give me grandchildren. Is it too much to ask? But Mama, she's there now. I will give you grandchildren. Just go. If he tries any rubbish, come and tell me. You know him, Yes, <laughs> You come and tell me. Ha ha. Okay, me do. You know me, you know me, Yes, Mama. Yes, Mama. You keep quiet here. You keep quiet there. What kind of bad luck is this? Snowing like that. What did I do? You are doing it again. I'm not doing it intentionally, no. See, you better find a way to stop that or you go to your room and snore your soul out. I want to sleep. You heard what Mama said. Eh? I will have to sleep in this room. If you like, you can go to the guest room and sleep. I am not leaving this room. Be a lady and stop acting stupid. So, I am not a lady because I snore. Eh, what? Is it my fault? so early. Look, if you're going to surprise. Hmm? What surprise are you talking about? I want to serve you breakfast in bed. Oh. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry about that, but I couldn't help noticing that you were not in bed. Baby. What? 
why don't you leave the surprise and come with me to bed because right now the only breakfast I want to have is you. Really? Yes. You know, I like it when you sound naughty. Mm. But you know you have work, right? Work? What to go to? Mm -hmm. Baby, when it comes to you, nothing else matters. Not even my job. <laughs> okay? I love you so much. In the kitchen? In the kitchen? What do you mean in the kitchen? Because you are proposing to me in the kitchen. Mm. No. <laughs> <laughs> Babe, not like I'm proposing to you right now, but I'm just making my intentions known. You know I love you. And I also want to spend the rest of my life with you too. And have beautiful babies with your cute eyes. <laughs> And your cuteness. Mm. Oh. Me, cute. Mm -hmm. You're very Please. cute. You're watching me. <laughs> Talking about babies. Why don't you go inside and start making a baby? Now? Yes. Right now? Uh -huh. No! Why not? No. I mean, we've been together for how long? There's nothing wrong with that baby. I know. We meet him. One step. Hmm. Oh. You're running away from daddy. No. Yes, you are running away from daddy. Maybe I'm not. I love Nathaniel, Nathaniel, hmm? why are you here? Nathaniel, did you sleep here? What does it look like, Mama? Look, I've been in. Yes. Go and ask your daughter in law. Why did your husband sleep here? Huh? He just got up and left the room. He said I was snoring and disturbing his sleep. Yeah, why did you snore now? Huh? Why did you snore? Mama, hmm? what kind of question is that? I'm a fan of mama. Are you asking me? I'm working at you. Did anything happen last night? Like a what? Uh, did you do it? Did you? Do what? Ah, ah. Go see Kanka. Don't you know what husband and wife do in their rooms? Don't you know? Mm. Eh? Mama, nothing happened. Nothing happened? Hey! You mean you wasted last night? You just wasted it? Mama, you know your son does not like me. Eh? Then, make him to like you. How? Okay. I will teach you how. I will tell you how. Ha! You know that? Eh? Mama, uh -uh. The one you told me, he nearly gave me slap on my face. I tell you, it's big one. Go This one will work. And I know this one is definitely going to work. Oh, I need grandchildren. Is it too much to ask? Oh, 
Fine. I think luck is on my side today. <laughs> what are you doing here? It's past closing hour and our Lani has already gone home. I'm not here for your boss. I'm here for you. Oh really? Yeah. Why? Claire, since the last time I saw you, you've been stuck in my head. I can't get you out of my stupid head. <laughs> it's not funny. Okay, fine. What are you doing tonight? Mm, nothing. Why ah. do you ask? Can I take you on a dinner date? Please. <laughs> Come on. Fine. <laughs> All right, then. Ladies first. Let's go to my car. You're looking busy for my Thank you. So Incompetent for the deal. Frank, you are making a big mistake. Oh my God. If this dinner happens in my house, we are still going to lose this deal. Come on, don't just spoil my mood. Fix it. It's your house. I should fix it. Yes, it is your house. Did you ask me before fixing that, that date in my house? Nathan, you're a big boy. Fix it. Frank. Frank, I am talking to you. Frank, we will have that dinner. Today went well. Yes, sir. It was okay. Thank God. Mm. Uh, Mama, where is Ngozi? Oh, she's in the kitchen. Oh, uh, Ngo. Uh, uh, no, 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 Mama, it's, it's okay. Huh? Just leave her. Uh, I have been meaning to ask you this question. When are you leaving? Hmm? When are you leaving? Chimu. Yay! Are you pursuing me from the house? Uh, now. Uh, um, huh? No, no, no. What I meant was, I, I want to know when you are leaving so I can make the proper arrangements. <laughs> Gladys, Gladys. Nathaniel. Mama. Do you think I am a fool? No. Eh? In a ceremony, Nanya, you think I am a fool. Now, I have told you this. I am saying it again. Have it right here. I am not going out of this house until 
my daughter-in-law gets pregnant. I fear it. Mama, that will never happen. Ah, yes. Why? Is she not a woman? Mama, she's a woman, but look at her. And a very fine woman like that. Mama, we are not in the same class. Look, I'm here and she's here. Hey. It's not going to be possible. Hey, hey. bring her up. We you brought her up, no? Go on, on at the same level, get one. Bring her up to your level. Nathaniel. Hey, Nathaniel, I want you to give me grandchildren. Mama. Give me grandchildren. I, I don't give, think this is too much to I, ask. I will give you grandchildren. Uh -huh. But right now, I am not ready. Why are you postponing it? Why? Mama, I am not ready. You are not ready? Yes. Akoko. Akoko Ikoja. Dear Mama, you are back. When did you come back? I came uh, a while ago. Eh, hey, food will soon be ready. Uh, no, no, I don't bother. I've already eaten. Eh, hey, yeah. <clears throat> This money, I want you to buy yourself some clothes, make your hair, and buy yourself some nice shoes. Hmm. I have some guests coming in tomorrow, they are very, very important to me. These things that you're going to buy, that's what I want you to wear tomorrow. Good, thank you. Uh, don't thank, thank you. me yet, Mama. Hmm? Please, I want you to help her to make some nice. Delicacies. I will do just that. This is you. what I want you to do now. This is what you should be doing. No. If no. you guys need anything, I'll be in my room. <laughs> it was organism. No. All this money. Hey. Cookie. Okay. 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 Uh, what? Take this one. Mm -hmm. Take this one. Uh, this one can do for the, the, the Okreka dresses that he's talking about. How much is Okreka wake up? This bent down select. How much is it in the market? Some are 200. Even the, the, the better ones, 500. This one is even too much. Mm -hmm. Mama, why now? Why? why? Why what? I told you I am saving up to start tomato business. Tomato business? How much is a basket of tomato? Eh, this one is even too much. Let me take some, some set. I want to be to Go and finish it. Daddy, go. You should have stayed. You should have stayed for us. I looked for you everywhere. <laughs> this conversation again? Nathan, you, you're not serious. What is funny? Why are you laughing? I should have fought for us. Nathan, your mother pushed me away. You chose your mother over me. So what am I supposed to fight for? A man who chose his mother over me? Hell no. I won't do that. For us. 
for every good thing that we had. I just wanted you to fight! You're very selfish. Also, you expect me to fight alone while you sit pretty and be a mama's boy? No, 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 no. I was never a mama's boy. Yes, you were, Nathan. You were. Look, you're married. Just go back to your wife and forget about the past. You think it's easy? You think it is easy? You call that thing that I'm in a marriage? Well, for your satisfaction, I am in hell! For my satisfaction? Yes. You're so full of yourself. Also, you think by telling me that I would jump into your arms and forget about everything? Nathan, you took six years away from my life. And you're not even sorry. And yet you blame me for everything that happened. Leave. I, I, I am so sorry. I said, leave and don't come back. I promise. Easy, man. Come on, easy. Don't you think you're drinking too much? I want to ease my pain. And you think this will ease your pain? Hold yourself. I want Alani. I want her back. It's too late for that. What do you mean it's too late? Huh? What do you mean it's too late? Come on, stop doing this to yourself. Hey, are you listening to me? It's okay. You need to move on. Alani has moved on. How do you expect me to do that? Have you seen that thing that I'm married to? Come on, Nathan. You've taken too much alcohol. I think it's high time we went home. Yeah. Come on. I'm not going home. Because if I go home, I might do something stupid to her. Don't do this to yourself. Look at this. I am not going. Just leave me to drink. Nathan. Excuse me. But no, 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 no. This is the last. Come on, we're going home. Frank. How much? Frank. Are you my friend? Yes. Then don't do this. Please. Please, bring the bottle for me. Don't do this now. Come on, let's go. I beg go. I beg go. Okay. Or gap. Or gap. Okay, fine. She can come in at any time. Mm 
My bed. What is it? Why are you shouting? Oh, why did you take advantage of me? Hey, I, I, I did not do anything, no. You were the one that came back and started talking sweet to me. Shut, shut you, up. You, you, me, said sweet things to you. You, hey, you don't remember. Hey. You called me princess and said. Shut up, me, call you princess. You saw that I was drunk and you didn't stop me? Why should I? You are my husband. My God. Get out of here. Get out of here this minute. Why are you so angry? Do you want me to hit you? Get out! Get out! that happened between us. He woke up and behaved like nothing happened. Ngo, you, you mean that? Uh, yes, Mama. You are Nakana. Yeah! You know what? Then why you, you shouldn't be crying. Huh? You should not be crying. You should be happy. Hey, I knew it. I knew it was going to happen. Oh, yeah, men and I know that my son loves you. I'm a He loves you. No, my mama. All he was trying to do is uh, playing hard to get. Mm. I know he loves mm -mm. you. He does not love me, Tata. He does not. He was drunk. He was not. He did not know what he was drunk, doing. Drunk, drunk again. Hapuchaya, hapuchaya. He loves you. He loves you. Oh, what can we do? Gala, 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 gala. Yeah, it's okay. Stop crying. Stop crying. Stop crying. Uh, I went to the market. Mm? I bought those dresses for you, mm? and so many other things. Go to my room on my bed. Bring that black line up. Gawa, stop crying. Stop crying. I'm here. I am here for you. Very, very. Uh, give me back. I'm not. Go and bring it. Hey, <laughs> Mama, I like this. You one. like this one? How much you know? Anya, 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 this one is 500 naira, eh? Then the other one's 300. Hey! Mm. Mama! Inga. 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 Do you know why I bought this one? Why? I bought this one because of when you. Inga, <laughs> <laughs> baby! Mama, uh -huh. Mama eh? uh -huh. if I wear this one, I can't allow the wife to If you fall for me, why hand. What's that? <laughs> I know you. See, there are other things there, mm -hmm. like uh, umu powders, mm. umu pancake, oh. eh? umu pancake. You know those pancake. They are. Ima, eh? I'm a problem here. The mouth. Yes. Hey. Bento. Yeah, you know good things. Obro no din kaka ine toga. Mane umu di pancake kaya na de tebe. Intesia ya. If I pass, you must turn and look at me. Hey. Yes. <laughs> Do you know what they call me then? What? Olu Bajie boy. Abura Miketa. Now that I'm ugly and old. Wow. Uh, this one, eh? Mm. Ki, 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 where do they apply? See, these people are going to come tomorrow. Our visitors. Mm. It is before tomorrow. I will teach you how to dump them. 
I know how to rub all of them. Mama, now. thank eh? you. I will teach you how to rub thank them. Thank you. Go inside there and pack your things out of my room. Makadil, Makadil, see, you don't have the right to ask your wife to pack out of your room. Mama, you don't have don't want to right. see this thing in my room again. It's not the thing, she's your wife. If I see her in my room again, I will kill her. You, you won't do such thing. Let her try it. Let her try it. What you try it? What is even your problem? They are one that. I'm a general beating. I'm a general beating. If you like, go and kill yourself. I don't care. You want me to kill myself? Yes. You want me to you, die? You. You want me to die of here? Don't die. Nobody 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 die. Ah, hey, hey. Mr. Lani. Mr. Quinton, good to see you. Thank you, you're Guess welcome. Patrick. Hey. Hi, hey. excellent. <laughs> I've almost given up that you won't give it to me again. <laughs> I do not disappoint. Although it was hard to let go, but after thinking about it last night, I figured out the best way to bury my past is by letting go of my past. We will see about that. I also want to thank you for what you did the last time. <laughs> hey, Miss Alani. I'm a businessman. I don't do favors. What do you mean? Good. You remember the last time you came to my house with one young man. What is that his name? Uh, Frank. Yes, Frank. You remember what I told you? Hi, Frank. What are you doing in my gallery? Are you with Nathan? No, on the contrary, he doesn't even know I'm here. Please sit. <clears throat> Is everything all right? Uh, nothing much. It's just I need a favor from you. Okay. So what do you want? Okay, it's about one Mr. Clinton Omowa. Uh, he's one of the biggest art critics. In Africa, I read his article about your work. Um, yes, I, I know him very well. He has been to my gallery many times. Wow, that's a big relief. Honestly. <laughs> what business do you have with him? He's a dangerous con artist. Oh, I'm quite aware. Uh, I've dealt with uh, men like Mr. Clinton so many times. Actually, we don't need him. It's his money we need so we can invest in a Swedish company for a high-tech medical supply. Mm. One you've not seen in Africa before. Okay. And, and we want to be the first to bring it here. So Mr. Clinton is the only one that can make that happen. Hmm. So... Is it loan or a corporate bond? A hey, corporate bond. And how well do you trust this company? Oh, about that. We've done our research. It's 100% legit. <sighs> so why do you need my help? <laughs> so, Nathan and I... No, no, no. If this has anything to do with Nathan, I am sorry I cannot help you. Are you sure? What do you mean? Aladi, I know you are still very much in love with Nathan. No. Never. Okay. If you say so. Oh. And that's my homeboy. I thought you said you're over him. Is this not obsession? 
How did you know that was there? Let's say a little bit told me. Claire, I am going to kill her. Come on, Alani. No need for that. You took your time and met this wonderful painting. That is Nathan. If this is not an obsession, so what do we call it? See, all I'm asking you is to, for you to help us make this deal happen. And I promise you in return, you will have Nathan back. How are you going to do that? He's married. He is miserable. So, if I agree to help you, how are you going to convince Nathan to take me back? See, Alan, Nathan, do not need convention. He wants you back. And besides, you know this already. Yes, you know. Salani, I can see you came with a little friend. Yes, I did. Make yourselves comfortable. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Great. No, thank you. We are fine. What about you, young man? No, thank you, sir. I'll pass. Mr. Salani, it's been a long time. You are okay? Yes, very fine. Thank you. Let's say you come with my painting. Oh, yes, that's true. I'm putting finishing touches to it. So once I'm done, we will get it. You know, that's a lame excuse. I'm sorry. I'm sorry about that. It's all right. What do you want? Okay, um, this is Mr. Frank. Mr. Frank, this is Mr. Clinton. <laughs> There is no need for formal introduction. I know Frank very well. Oh. What do you want? Okay, um, Mr. Clinton. Not you, Mr. Alani. Young man. Uh, me. Can't you talk? Oh, me, sir. Uh, no. Okay, yes, I can talk. Talk? I don't have all day. Uh, sir, it's, it's about our proposal. Uh, I'm really sorry about what happened the last time, sir. Mm. It's not you that is supposed to apologize to me, but your boss. <laughs> my boss? No, sorry. <laughs> my colleague, sir. <laughs> mm. He that couldn't beat up the time for our first appointment. How am I supposed to entrust millions of naira into a company that is run by a man that don't have value for time? Is that possible? Sorry. Sir, um, we apologize for what happened the last time. Give us another chance. I'll personally oversee the running of this business this time around, sir. Please. What did you say? Huh? You that couldn't do a proper presentation to hold me back that day. How do you want me to believe that you run a business ranking into millions? Well, sir, mm, this time around, eh? Um, Mr. Clinton, yes. if you don't mind, I would like to say something. Go ahead. You see, I assure you that these men are capable. They will deliver. I can assure you of that. And I can vouch for them. So you can really vouch for him? Absolutely. What is your relationship with him? Uh... They've been an old friend. I've known them way back. It's okay. I will do the business with him for your sake. But you owe me a favor. I am willing to do anything. Young man. Sir, sir. Congratulations. Thank you so much, sir. You now have a deal with me. Thank, thank, thank you so much, sir. You don't need to thank me. Thank the lady. Oh, <laughs> of course, Mr. Uh, Miss Alani. Uh, but, sir, I promise you this time, I will not fail you. Thank you once again, Mr. Clinton. We'll be on our way now. That's up, Remember, you owe me. 
Vividly. Yes. Good. So, but what do I owe you? <laughs> Very simple, Miss Alani. Marry me. Meanwhile, take that thing inside. Clinton in his rightful place. Trust me. You know what I'll be to guess in the first place. Yes, sir. Make sure Nathan comes back to me after this game. Else, I will come back to you. And stay away from the city. Stop using that to get the police. What is this thing you've done on her face? 
Uh, he's makeup now. You, 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 you call this thing makeup? You call this thing makeup? And why is she wearing this dress, embarrassing herself at the gates? Which dress? This dress that she's wearing. Uh, this is one of the dresses you said, said I should buy for her. Mama, so all the money I gave you people, this is what you could get? This, this, this thing! Oh, 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 oh. Why do you like to insult me? Okay, will you shut your mouth? Why are you shutting her up? Eh? Do you know that this girl is a very good girl? Eh? She said she wants to, to buy uh, 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 tomato. This basket of tomato. I sell to help you. Which nonsense business? No, tell me, which nonsense business? Look, look at her face. What is wrong with my face? Mm -hmm. You look like a witch. I'm Musu. So if my guests were to come to this house, this is what I'll be dealing with. Leave this girl alone. Ah, ah, Natalia, leave this girl alone. Don't mind her. I hope you have not come to play the victim or pass the blame. Why are you being so cold to me? How am I supposed to act? Can we start over? As friends? It's too late for that. What do you mean it's too late? I'm getting married. What? No, you're kidding, right? Why? So you think you're the only one that can get married and I can't? Nathan, you've ruined everything. You did. You're just the mama's boy who couldn't stand up to his mother. I tried. You tried? Yes. Nathan, your mother threw me out of the house. She even questioned my parents' upbringing. And you did nothing about it. That is a lie. <laughs> so now I'm lying. Hmm? You don't know what happened that day. Hey, Una! Good afternoon, Ma. Ah, Bobo, Ma. You're welcome. Who are you with? Uh, Mama, this is the beautiful lady that I've always told you about. Mm -hmm. Alani. It's my mother. It's so nice to meet you, Ma. Nathan has told me so much about you. <clears throat> Alani? No, Alani. Whatever. Do you know what Alani is? No, I know I Alani. Ma, it's Alani. Not Olani. Mm. She's. She's the one I want to marry. Mm. Is she not the one you have been talking about? Yes. Yeah, the one that is from a very far place. Mama, bam, she's the one. Ah. <laughs> now, you cannot marry her. Huh? Mm? Why? You can't marry her. Ah. Don't you know you are my only son? You cannot go to that far, far place to go and marry. You can't even marry in the next village. Come to talk of a place I will, I will, that will take me two days to go to. Mba, no. Mba. Mama, we've been dating for six years now, and we are like husband and wife. Eh, yes. It's so good. The young one as a You have been living with a man for six years, a man that has not done anything traditionally on your head. That is the man you have been living with for six years. I don't think your mother did a good job in, on your head. Is it? What is all this? Now? What you is embarrassing me? You know, I'm embarrassing. What I'm saying is that you cannot marry. You cannot. 
Look at the person you want to marry. You can't. As a guess, somebody that has not done anything on your head. Nathan. Nathan, what is this? Mama, have I offended you before? You have not offended me. But I am saying that this is my only son. He cannot marry my woman. See the person you want to marry. Look at her. She's almost naked inside out. Hey, this is the first time you, you are coming to me, isn't it? And you are dressed like this. Neta. Neta. Mama. You cannot marry. Mama, stop this now. You are embarrassing me. Uh -huh. You are embarrassing me. Izu. I have to go. Huh? It seems I'm not welcome in your house. Of course you are not. Go. Hey, 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 hey. You. Why do you think you are going to marry? Yes, What do you think you are going to I'm going after my girlfriend. Your girlfriend? If you try that. Let me tell you. Don't make one more move and I will, I will slide my, 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 my throat. Mama. I will slice it yeah, now, you will see. Mama, please. Put that knife down. Please bring it down. I will not go after her. Please just bring that knife down, please. What, what, what is it? Eh? What is it? Mama, bring the knife down now. Bring it down. You have to make a promise to me. A promise? Yes, you have to promise me that you will never look away. You will never. Oh, you are still doing Mama, it. she's gone. I, I, I promise. I will not look away. I won't. Bring, bring that knife down. Please. But there is one more promise you have to what make. Promise again now? What is all this? Man, you have to promise me that you are going to marry whosoever I present to you to marry. Okay. I promise I will marry whosoever you bring for me to marry. Please, bring the knife down. Cross your heart. I cross my heart. <laughs> She vowed to kill herself if I had gone after you that day. You were never serious. You and I know that your mother loves her life more than anything. Why would she want to kill herself? Why? Alani. She only used that against you because she knows that you have a very soft spot for her. Can you listen to me? I want to make things right. Please, give me a chance. It's too late, Nathan. What? I'm getting married to Mr. Clinton. You... You're getting married to Mr. Clinton? Wait, the same Mr. Clinton that I know? But why would you want to marry an old grumpy fool? It's none of your business! Oh. Oh. Wow. Hey, sir, man, man. Why are you not home yet? It's almost midnight. I have to finish this up. Or you're avoiding home. I was shocked to hear that it, uh, it, the part of the agreement was that Alani was going to marry him. Honestly, we are pulling out. No, bro, it's too late. We have not signed the agreement. I have. What? How can you do that without my consent? Exactly. I knew you were going to react like this. Frank, why would you lie to me? 
We are not doing this. Bro, I did this for us. What do you mean you did this for us? What is that? My signature is not on that document, which means it is void. You think I can make a good decision for us? At the detriment of other people's lives? No. When you're done with your personal affairs and you come back to your senses, you can put your signature where it belongs. But you have lost your mind. Bro, this is the best thing for us. No, 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 no. It's just you. This is the best thing for you. And let me tell you something. Whatever comes to this deal, I am part of it. Sorry, bro. You are really part of this. Right. Read my lips. I am not. Take this thing out of my face. You need to sign this. I will not sign it! Later. What do you mean by you are, you are leaving? Uh, is it not obvious that you don't want me in your house? Ha. Is it not? Uh, let me go back to my husband's house. Uh, at least I have a house in my, in my, in my village. How can what you say you? something like that? Okay, if it's because of what I said the last time, Mama, you should know that I was not serious. I was not serious. You were very serious. You were very serious. And I think I have overstayed my welcome. Uh, <laughs> I am very, very happy now. I will go. Mm? No, uh, at least my mission has been accomplished. And, and what mission is that? Uh, no, I am very, very, very sure. It, it is not even possibility because I know it has happened. Uh, what happened between you and Ngozi the last time? I am very, very sure she will be pregnant. Huh? And yes, you know, and I say, ah, ah. I am expecting my first grandchild. I, isn't it wonderful? You are um, expecting your first grandchild? Oh yes, oh yes. Mama, eh? If Ngozi is pregnant, eh. I will kill that girl. You cannot do it. Now, oh. listen, oh, listen. Oh. In our Bakashanya, you cannot do a thing like that. No problem. See, don't allow me get any complaint from her. Because if I do, what I will do when I come here? <laughs> Nobody and nobody will say that I am wrong. Mama, I am not joking, no. I am not joking. Me, me, look at me. Does it look as if I'm joking? Does it look like I'm joking? No problem. You should be, you should be very happy. Me, I am very happy. I, I'm very soon. I will be expecting my grandchild. <laughs> Gladys will be expecting her grandchild. Are you pregnant? No. So you're lying to me? Because we are pregnant. I am not pregnant. If you are not pregnant, then why is Mama going about saying that you are pregnant? I don't know. Did you take any contraceptive? Co contraceptive? Nathaniel, I have for my cabico. Hey. 
after that mistake that happened the last time? Did you take any drugs? For what? To prevent you from getting pregnant. Hey! Why should I? Are we not married? Jose, if it happens that you are pregnant, I will kick that baby out of your stomach. Do I make myself clear? Do you hear me? Yes! Nathan, what do you want? We need to talk. Make it brief. I have some deliveries to do. Frank told me what you did for me. I didn't do it for you. Then for who? I did it for myself. Look. Look, I have many big clients that come highly recommended by Mr. Clinton. He gives my work good reviews and that has earned me many awards and recognition. So don't assume that everything is all about you. I can see your mind is already made up. Yes. Hello, sir. Oh, hey. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. Ma'am, Mr. Larry is done with the fumigation. Okay, that's fine. So did he tell you how long it would take before we move into the house? Yes, he said a week or two. All right, that's fine. You know what? Book a hotel room for two. Okay. All right, ma'am. Wait. Why would you pay for a hotel for two weeks when you can stay with me? I am fine. I don't need your help. And Marova, I am still that Yoruba girl your mother despises so much. Alani, I mean, how can you... Paying for two weeks in a hotel seems like a lot of expenses to me. I can afford it. Yes, I know you can afford it. But just come and stay with me. That reminds me, I, I have something for you. Wow, you, you did this for me? I spent one year doing this. It's my best work. What did I do to deserve you? But I am not yours. Alani, listen to me. You I... haven't told me if you like the painting. Oh, I don't like it. I love it. Thank you. Will there be room for my girl and I? The house is big enough. We'll be coming tomorrow. I'll be waiting for you. Thank you. But, but for real though, this is really dope. I, I love it. <laughs> I well, just, I'm glad you like it. I'm just gonna hang this in my house when I get home. This is dope. to Alani and Nathan. Oh, I don't even know where to start from. But we'll start from the very beginning. <sighs> they loved each other so much. Mm -hmm. But not as much as I love you. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, you love me? Isn't it obvious? Hmm. Anyways, 
If they love each other as much as you say, why are they not together? Uh, Nathan's mom had a problem with Alani's uh, tribe. Oh, really? Yeah, that's why she married a village girl for Nathan. Hmm. <laughs> Someone she can control, right? Possessive mothers are like that, and I don't get it. Why? I doubt that's the case. So what then? You know, Nathan is the only child. And so? She was just being a protective mother. Really? Yeah. Okay. I'm Yoruba. Do I have to be worried? Yes, you have to be worried. What? <laughs> Come on, I'm joking. <laughs> I'm oh joking. my god. No. And indirectly, are you actually proposing to me? No! Tell me the truth. No! I would like that. Come on. <laughs> no! Come on, don't get I, what makes you think I want to get married to you? I know. for just one week. Why are all the bags? Just to us like safe. Mm. What's your plan? <sighs> to get my man back. No way. And all the story about fumigation? Part of the plan. And Mr. Clinton? <laughs> Leave him to me. And by the way, where were you all night? I was with Frank. <laughs> Frank? Yeah. He's serious? Mm-hmm. I think he is. Come on, let's go. Okay. <laughs> okay. okay. Let's wait. Bro. What made you change your mind? Because I trust you. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Tell me the truth. I would not sit down and watch Alani marry a man like Mr. Clinton. And I pray, I pray that you're right about this deal. Please, don't go against Mr. Clinton. He's too dangerous. Where's the rest of the documents? Nathan, are you from listening to me? Alani is my responsibility and I have to do anything and everything to protect her. Bro, what about your wife? I don't have a wife. I have to go. Alan is on the way to the house. Nathan, this is so wrong. Really? Yes. You think you're in a position to tell me what is right and wrong? You think so? to drive in. My husband does not have any woman friend. So please leave. Wait. You are his wife? Eh uh eh. -huh. Well, he's actually expecting us. He did not tell me that anybody's coming. So I will not open this gate for you. And Bian, don't touch this gate. Though. You know, I can't believe he actually married that, that woman. Well, I think she's adorable, okay? Adorable? Yes, yeah. please. Alani? What are you still doing out here? Well, that's because your wife refused to allow us coming. Um, I am truly sorry. Please, I will open the gate for you. Why don't you drive in, okay? Forgive me, I'm sorry.
How did you love it? Sorry, Dad, please come inside. Why did you refuse to open the gate for them? I don't know them. Did they not tell you that they were here to see me? You did not tell me anyone is coming. Yeah. What is my offense now? Every time you're looking for what to shout, shout, shout. Come on, will you shut up your mouth? You see these people here? They are my guests. They'll be staying here for a week or two. Please, be of best behavior. I don't know. Hi, my name is Alani. It's nice to finally meet you. Um, so, how about our luggage? Oh, your bags. Um, mm -hmm. Ngozi, go to the car and get your bags. Hey! Who? Me? I have something I am doing in the kitchen because. Um, Ngozi. Don't worry, I'll get the bags. This place has changed so much. Better, I suppose. Yeah, it's perfect. It's good. Please make yourself comfortable. Do you care for anything to drink? Water is fine. Just water? Yeah. How can you come to my house and just take water? Let me give you your favorite. You know, I still know your favorite. Catch you. Alright. You want it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No. Draw me on some. As if you're not the one that insulted me out there. You told me not to open gate for somebody I don't know. You even told me to carry their bags. Me! Now you listen to me. These people are my guests. Throughout the time that they're going to stay in this house, I want you to behave yourself. But why are they staying here? Is this your problem? Yes. Is this your house? Yes, it is my house. It is your house, Babogidia. Rubbish. Natalia, you will tell me why they are staying here. Oh. Hmm. Holy Spirit, I call upon you this night as we are going to sleep. Cover this entire house with the blood of Jesus. Cast and bind any evil thing that is surrounding this place. Who is this person that does not know that night has come? Eh? Interrupting evil spirits and the good spirits. What do you want? Um, I noticed that you're not happy that we're here. So, if it is you that your husband is bringing two women into the house without informing you, Will you be happy? Uh, no, certainly I will be angry. And that is the more reason why I'm here, to apologize on his behalf. Who are you to apologize on his behalf? See, don't like to be nice to me, oh, because I know your type. Girls that are purely around, looking for homes to break. But you see me, I am fire. And I will give it to you people. Hot, hot. Um, sorry. Nobody is here to break your home. I have noticed that your husband does not have any atom of love or respect for you. But if you let me, I will help you. My husband loves and respects me. From what happened out there tonight, I do not see how much he loves or respects you. You don't even know me. Why would you want to help me? Because I was once in your shoes. I know exactly how it feels for people to want to walk all over you just because they think you do not belong to their world. Let me help you. I don't trust you. Listen, you do not need to trust me to allow me to help you. Why are you girls here? Why? Fine. I'll tell you why we are here. Our house was communicated and we were asked to stay away for a week or two.
So I saw Nathan's wife and she's such a sweetheart. Why doesn't he like her? That one. She's not literate, pure Olodo. <laughs> Excuse me? Is that it? That is not enough, babe. She can be taught. I can personally blend her in. Really? Mm -hmm. You know Alani likes Nathan, right? And Alani is your boss. You should be on her side, not trying to help Ongazi instead. Baby, Alani is my boss. I know that. But that doesn't mean I owe her my loyalty. Alani doesn't even like Nathan. She is up to no good and I am going to find out what it is before she destroys herself. I beg you in the name of God, stay out of their trouble. And besides, I don't want to see you get hurt. Baby, I'm fine. I'm not saying you're not fine. All I'm asking is for you to stay out of their trouble. I'm sorry, I, I don't think I can promise. No, 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 you have to do that for me. I don't want to see you get hurt, trust me. You don't want to come in between these two people. Baby, nobody's going to hurt me and I am good. I know you're going to do that for me. Uh, come, what will I even offer you? <laughs> Okay, let's see. Um... Are you going out? Yes, I have an urgent appointment. Okay. Okay. This place is a mess. Don't worry, I'll tidy it. Thank you. It's fine. All right. I'll see you later. Okay. Just help me keep this in my makeup. Bye. in your house now just for a week bro that's not a nice decision at all honestly it's not yeah she needed accommodation and i helped your ex in your matrimonial home it's not good for your marriage man. <clears throat> she's not just anybody besides she wanted us to patch things up so what changed Bro, this is so wrong. This is so wrong. I wanted you guys to pack things up. Not she sleeping in your matrimonial home. That's not it. I don't know what you're talking about. Don't worry, she'll do so. Are you sure? Mm How -hmm. soon? Oh, fine, fine, fine. I have to run. Run to where? You're always running. Yeah. Why are you running? Alani, what are you doing in Nathan's house? I had a little accommodation problem and he offered to help. Any problem? Alani, Nathan is married. Stay away from him. <laughs> Frank, Frank, Frank. You want me to stay away from Nathan? Yes, and what's funny? And who are you to tell me that? You think I don't know that you were using me? You must think that I am stupid. You wanted to sell me off to Mr. Clinton when you know how I feel about Nathan and how he feels about me. Hmm? He made a mistake in his marriage. And he wants to correct that. So why does he bother you? Or are you hiding something? What are you talking about? <laughs> then tell me. Why all of a sudden you want me to stay away from Nathan? Why? Alani, what? What are you hiding? Alani, what you're doing Frank, is wrong. Nathan should be the one to decide who he wants to be with. You are not in the position to make that decision for him. If you will excuse me, I have work to do. Alani, what you are doing is wrong. Leave Nathan alone, he's married. I am just taking charge of my life. And besides, you can't deal with a man like Clinton, he's too dangerous. 
Leave that for me. See, stay away from Nathan. Are you sure your mother would be pleased to see me here? She's not coming back anytime soon, so there's nothing to worry about. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm very sure. Can you not embarrass yourself? I am embarrassing myself. Eh, Juanata? This shameless woman is here, busy feeding you. And you are balancing there, easy from her hand. Eh? Nathan, please caution your wife. Babuchiano, are you mad? Hey, 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 that's, that's enough. Enough. Nathan, you are shouting at me. Because of this, this, this language! I, I said enough! Are you, are you, are you mad? Huh? Are you okay? Can I talk to you? Uh, sure. Sit down. Um, I found something on your desk yesterday. I didn't want to talk to you about it at home because I didn't want anybody to hear us. Mm, what is what is that? Why did you touch this? I mean, you shouldn't touch things that you do not understand. I clearly understand things like that. It's fraudulent and it can land you in jail. It's like I do not even know you. Of course you don't know me. It looks like I've given you too much leverage. From today. Do not touch my things without my permission. Then you should fire me. Because I cannot sit and watch you put yourself into trouble. Stop apologizing. It's just like you would have gone down the house. What's bothering you? Darling, uh -huh. can you be honest with me? Alright. If you have a friend or someone really close to you that is doing something illegal and could get into serious problem, what will you do? I'll try and stop them. 
And if you fail, will you turn them in? Uh, it all depends. If it doesn't have any connection with me, I'll just let them do their thing. And why are you asking? It's nothing. It's nothing, okay? Can you please help me finish up with the kitchen? I'm having a strong headache and I need to rest now. Now I'm worried. Mm -hmm. Babe, are you sure you're fine? Babe, I just said I'm having a headache. Oh, fine. Okay. That's true. Thank you. Okay. Yeah, I am just tired. Ngozi, you want your husband back, right? Uh -huh. but what does it have to do with this thing? You know your husband likes Alani, right? That white bitch. Mm -hmm. And that is because of how she looks. Uh, so you are saying that if I start behaving like a white witch, mm -hmm. my husband will Yes, exactly my point. And you're even more beautiful than she is. I got a fun of Guaca. Stop whining me. Can you always speak what I can understand whenever we're together, please? Why are you helping me? Is the white witch not your friend? She's my friend. But that doesn't mean I have to support her in everything she does. So please, shall we continue? Okay, get up. So stand with so much confidence. It is your stand. Easy. You have the floor all to yourself. Okay? All right? Stand. That's it. So take your best step. No, 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 no. <laughs> You're so funny. It's your kumi, eh? I don't know why he does not like playing. Since I came into this house, I have never, never, never seen Nathaniel play. If I play, he will shout at me. Um, what's your denomination? Eh? I mean, what church do you attend? Oh, I am Pentecostal. Mm -mm. You attend Pentecostal. So which of them? Um, <laughs> don't worry about that. And your husband, where does he worship? He is Catholic. Okay. Uh, I attend Catholic here too, but I don't know some of their players. Mm, okay. But that shouldn't be a problem because it doesn't matter. All that matters is um, the prayer. Every church serves the same purposes, which is to pray to God and wow. worship Him. Wow. Mm, we'll come to that later. Okay. But for now, tell me, do you like my face? I mean, do you like my makeup? Oh, <laughs> it is fine. Oh. It's very fine. Okay. <laughs> very well then. I will teach you how to wear makeup. Hey! You mean it here? Yeah. Hey! I will like it though. Oh. Because the one mama did for me before. Okay. Natania did not like it at all. Oh, don't worry, my dear. 
I will teach you how to make it look like mine and he will like it. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. Thank I like you. you I like you too. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Yes, I have it. Okay, I'll be on my way now. Hey, Miss Alani. Mr. Clinton. You're most welcome. Thank you, Mr. Clinton. Do you know you are the most beautiful and most intelligent and the smartest girl I have ever met in my life? Thank you for the compliment, Mr. Clinton. You're welcome. I think this is what we have always wanted. <sighs> oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Amazing. This is wonderful. This is too good to be true. Hmm. This calls for celebration. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, no. You see, I need to leave that house as soon as possible. Until things is well settled. And I must have that company under my name. Until then, there will be no celebration. Hmm. Yes. If you think so. In that case, I'll serve it till then. Yes, please. It's okay. Um, you've really done well. I am so happy and impressed. And <laughs> to the beginning of a good life. Yeah, so, um, okay, let's do this. How are you? I'm good. Where have you been? I've been looking for you all morning. Uh, I went to see a client. Oh, okay. Um, so, I was thinking, uh, maybe we should go have lunch? Lunch? Mm-hmm. Nathan, that won't be necessary. Because <sighs> I'm leaving. What? Why? Is, is, is this place not comfortable enough? No. Look, it's more than comfortable. But you see, a friend agreed for us to stay. And I don't want to inconvenience you and your wife. I am not complaining. Look, you can stay here for as long as you want. I know. But it seems your wife has a problem with that. And come to think of it, I am your ex. It's not wise for me to be here. 
you are not just my ex. You mean more than that to me. We would have been married if things didn't turn bad for us. You know that. You would have married her. It's past tense. You have married me. It's present tense. That means I am your wife. So, this Amusocha is your girlfriend before, and you brought her into this house. Okay? So you want to leave me and marry her? Hey! Nathaniel, you are very wicked. Obi Ologunko. Hey! Uh, Nathan, you can see that. And look, I don't want any more troubles. I think it's best I leave. You know, Alani, Alan, wait. Alani. Bye bye. You. Kiri! Alani! Ngozi, what is it? Why is your face like this? Nathan Malilim. Nathan insulted me. Me, Ngozi Wan Magnus. Nathan insulted me. Um, what really happened? So, Amuswacha is Nathan's girlfriend before. Nathan even told her that he would throw me out of this house and marry her. Nathan is very wicked. No, don't say that, Ngozi. Don't say that, please. Do not let this bother you, okay? I have something for you. I don't want anything. What I want now is to go back to my mother's house. I am tired of this house. You're not going anywhere, Ngozi. This is your husband's house. Get yourself off this mood and come and see what I have to show you. You will love it. I know. Come. Let's go. Can use this prayer book to pray for your husband, pray for your house, silently to your heart content. God hears prayers either ways. You can also encourage your husband to pray with you someday. Nathan. Mm -hmm. Nathan does not want me. He likes Samus Watcher. Because he don't say that. You're a very likable person. You are adorable too. Hmm? Nathan doesn't say your words, but I know someday he will. Thank you. Ngozi. You see, I need you to know that you're very unique in your own way. And I don't want you to let anybody look down on you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, Chineke Nuna. Genege Zibuti. God will give you a good husband. Oh, that! <laughs> Amen, amen to that. Thank you. And one more thing. We'll leave you. Yes. I think after everything that happened, Alan wants us to leave. So, your husband chose you after all. Me, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you very much. You're welcome. <laughs>
Do you mind if I join you? Let us pray. Good morning, baby. What took you so long? Oh, I'm so sorry, baby. I got caught up in the office. What's wrong? Frank, what are you doing with Alani? Alani, come on, no, come on. I don't have any interest in her. That is not what I am talking about. Okay. Whatever you're doing with Alani, you need to stop it. What do you know? I do not know so much, but I know she's up to no good with Mr. Clinton. You need to stop it before it's too late. I can't tell nothing anything. He's not going to believe me. You and I know how he feels for her. Do you know what they're planning? No, but Frank, I am leaving. What do you mean by that? I got a job from Lagos, and with the way the atmosphere is changing, I'm thinking of taking the job. Baby, you will not do anything unless I tell you to. Do you understand me? Please, Frank, do not tell anyone I told you about this. About what? What Promise are you even talking me. about? Promise me you won't tell anybody. Fine. Why should you not to trust Mr. Clinton? We have lost everything! What are you talking about? Before aiming for affiliation with this foreign company, I carried out a thorough investigation on this. I told you, I warned you, man. This is real. I warned you. Everything here is not real. We have been duped. All the money is gone. Come on, man. Don't put the whole blame on me. You trusted Alani blindly, too. Look at this. Look at this. She managed to lay her hands on the original documents of this bar, right under your own nose. Before you complain about my makeup, I am still learning. Um, you look absolutely ravished. Really, Your makeup 
this moderate effort. Well blended. Ah. Is it a good thing? Oh. Yes, it's. It's a very good thing. I did not hear you. Say it again. This is the side of the that we have changed. But I said you look very beautiful. Two things have happened this night. Things that have not happened for two years that we have been living together. Married. You are smiling with me and you said I am beautiful. I am sorry. I am so sorry for everything I have done to you these past years. I fail to realize your love and care. Thank you for your love. Thank you for your prayers. You were fighting unforeseen battles for me and I never noticed it. From today, I will be your husband. I will love you I will care for you. But most importantly, I will pray with you day and night. Oh, and uh, I will eat anything you cook for me for today. I am sorry. I cooked very special food for you. Thank you so much for your help. It's fine, it's okay. Uh -huh. Were you able to sort out everything? Yes, but we are still in it. Don't worry, with time things will turn out fine. I also found out that Alani and Mr. Clinton, they've been tangling all the while they were together at Australia. All this thing happening, these are things they've planned for so many years. Oh my God. Anyway, thank you so much again. Eh? What you did is not easy, you know, standing for something that is right, especially for someone that is so close to you. I know. I know how you feel right now. I did what I had to do. I did it for everybody. She fooled me too. Yes, she did. She... My flight is tomorrow morning. <sighs> don't worry. Trust me. I'll find you. Okay. And I'll make sure I don't keep you waiting. Okay. Oh, I'm going to miss, miss you so much. <laughs> oh my God.
My husband, Mr. Clayton Davidson, he transferred his shares to me. Well, it would shock you to know that. They've been married for two years now. Just so you know, nothing you do shocks me. Keep it late, Just consider this as payment for what you and your mother did to me. <laughs> what is so funny? You're so ridiculous. What happened to you? You and your stupid excuse of a mother ruined my life, Nathan. After years of building life with you, she threw me out like I was nothing. And you stood and watched. Remember you started this company with my money. You will go to jail for this. <laughs> and how do you intend to do that? I mean, you have no evidence against me. Clinton is in EFCC custody. What they have on him, trust me, will keep him in jail for the rest of his life. Officer, move her out of my seat. Don't touch me. Alan is over. Excuse me, madam. Come on, officer. Get up! This way, please. This way. I'll be back. I'll be coming for you. Madam, this way. Just, just look at the road. Let me be. Please, I'll officer, her back. Don't forget your back. Pick your back, madam. Just know that I will kill you. I will kill you by the time I get out of here. You're gonna kill it's me. It's not over. You're going to kill me. 